Okay people, so I am back with another Cyberpunk 2077 video. And now we've got, we've all got the 1.1 patch. I thought, well, out of curiosity, I wanted to test to see if our beloved glitches and exploits still work. I mean, you never know, there were no mention of them within the patch notes, but you never know people. Those stealthy patches they don't tell us about, but it stops some of these amazing exploits and glitches we can use. So today we're going to test them out. Now, if you don't know what I'm going on about, you don't know about any glitches or you're curious to see what they are, I will link two videos, I'll pin them at the top of the comments section and I'll link them within the video description. These two videos will take you to 10 plus glitches, which you need to be doing. You really do, people, you really do. Well, if you want to play the game legitly like I do my other characters, then yeah, it's fair enough. Don't use these glitches, but if you want to use and abuse them, that's fair enough. So, the main ones are the painting one, which gives you basically unlimited money. That's a killer costume. Um, there's the duplication glitch and a couple of XP glitches too. So, okay, so I've got myself a drop point machine. Now, if you don't know about the, the, the painting, it drops from a mission called the Space Oddity, which only appears on the map when you get to it. But again, you'll find that in that video linked down below. Okay, so the painting, as we know, you can sell this thing for 4K eddies normally. There we go. So we'll sell this machine two, oh, not that many. Jeez, go back. So we'll sell the machine one, two, three, four, and five to take its 20K eddies. Now, if we look here, they cost 4K each again to buy back, I'm guessing that is. We get back out and go back in. Usually before this patch, these will cost five eddies each to buy back. And yes, they do. So there we go, people. Now let me just prove to everybody that I'm playing on a 1.1 update here because you know some people will be like well you're not playing you ain't got the update you're still ready to go version 1.1 so let's go back to that okay so the duplication glitch now this one is a little bit more actually probably makes sense I skipped time by 24 hours just in case just in case I want that money again so the duplication glitch it's pretty simple stand in front of the console on Xbox it's the home button and the Y button at the same time. On PlayStation I believe it's pause and the home button and uh, should be triangle and on PC it's escape and R. So you do that and what happens is you'll see the background has gone all transparent and you'll know it's worked when the the text appears at the, at the screen top left. So what happens is, well actually I've done it wrong there, I need to sell the machine something first and duplicate it getting it back so what shall we sell the machine people? Okay, let's sell the machine. Let's just sell it. Um, well, these cost 1k each to buy back, so half my money with 350k. So let's just go 350 of these. Well, I'll just move it along, it's pretty easy. No, that, oh, that'll do, that'll do, don't really matter. Okay, so that's sold for. I don't know how much I got, I won't look in, but no matter. We're back out, we'll go back in. Now you'll see that these are 1,000 each to buy back. Now what we're going to do is we're going to duplicate these and you do that by doing what I just did. So stand in front of the machine, home button and Y button at the same time. You see the background is transparent, so that all up there is out of the screen. So if I just purchase all of these, I can constantly do this for ages. Let's constantly buy them. Constantly buy, actually how many of these I've actually got, which is probably, probably makes sense to, to check. But it seems to be working people, so I've got Oh nine. <laughs> okay, so it don't it don't work correctly with that, but that doesn't matter. <laughs> let's just do with something I haven't got many of because let's see. So let's go for a should we go for a piece of clothing or mud or bully mud or I've got these as well. So yeah, obviously you can duplicate the shards as well, people. So yeah, if you know about the places on the map where there's two shards in one place, you pick them up at the same time. One goes, well, one gets you straight away. One goes into your inventory. So you could duplicate these as well and keep spamming these out. Again, that will be linked. If you don't know what I'm talking about in that video down below. Okay, so I've got quick hat components. I've got 28 of them. Let's just try it with this. So let's just set it all 28. Why not? So I've got none left in my inventory. So if we do the glitch, Ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's buy them all back. Let's keep going. Just keep going. We'll just do this a couple of times. We, don't need, we just need to prove this works still. 
Don't really. Not really fussed. I should. I got to remind myself to get my money back out of the machine. <laughs> okay, so now if we look inside my inventory, I should have quite a lot more than 28 of them bad boys. There we go. So yeah, it still works. Works perfectly fine. Let me just get my money back, people. Get my money back. Sell it the paintings, obviously. 270k worth. So what's that about? I like that. Perfect. I should probably go a couple more. There we go. That'll do. And now just back out the machine. Buy them back. And we are good to crack on with another glitch, which will be um, where well, the duplication glitch works, the painting glitch works still to get your money back. Now I'm going to try the the XP one where you're rendering out the enemies and just cap them. So what I'll do is I'll go to that place in the map now because it's going to take me about five minutes to drive there or find a tra fast travel spot. So we'll just cut the video and I'll zoom in a second people. Okay people, so we're at that point on the map which I showcased quite a while back where you can get unlimited street cred, stealth and normal XP. Now the way this is done is pretty simple. You want to come to this part of the map, jump up on this roof, take out any enemies surrounding this roof. If you see them, there's normally some down here. One's over there I've killed and there's a couple just below here that I've killed too. But the aim of the game here is people and the unlimited stealth and street cred and that XP is coming through these guys here. Now this glitch works by you kill these, you run to the end of the roof, run back and they respawn back in because they render out which is just bizarre so you need to aim really for this car on your right but you need to have the projectile launch systems with the explosive rounds equipped because it just takes out everything unless you've got like a beastly ass 5 or 05 or something like that which just blows up the cars in one uh, but it's way easier just using this if you can if you've got good accuracy the thing is about this, it goes all over the place, you don't know where to aim it. But you want it to blow up that car right there. There you go, that blows up the car. See there, I didn't get stealth XP there. Oh, I do like stealth XP there. But if you kill off six with the first shot, you get way more. And you can just rinse and repeat this, people. It really is that simple. I haven't used this in a while, so I've just, I just got it down to exactly where to aim. But if you hit that car straight away on the first go, you just get a ton of XP. I'm going to try it again. Let's see if I can do it. I don't remember where I used to aim. You don't actually look at the car. You aim like to the right slightly. But either way, people, this still works. Um, there you go. That's better. This still works. You can run to the back of the roof or run to the... Run back and it renders the enemies back in. So if there's any glitch you used which did this kind of thing, it still works. And I'm guessing as well. Yeah, perfect, and I'm guessing as well that the um, the glitch where you want to roll a legendary. Obviously, you know if you find a legendary, you want to maximize. If it's a clothing item, you want to maximize mod slots. You just create a save uh, and keep reloading that save. But you can also just run 50 meters away from it. So if you run 50 meters away from said loot and run back, it also reveals the stats, and that that works too. So just keep that in mind. Now, what we're going to do is there's one more XP glitch, which I'm going to. Uh, try out but this is more so for people that are just starting the game I mean this can be you have to be what like a level 20 to get these uh, inside where I think I don't know do you I'm not actually entirely sure but there's one you can do more or less near the start of the game who are you talking to boy yeah, there's one you can do right at the start of the game which gives you unlimited eddies unlimited XP street cred XP so we're going to load that up because I've still got to save on my other character. So we'll get back to you in a quick second, people. Okay, guys, so we've loaded it in. And the mission is I walk the line. It's when you meet the voodoo boys. You have to go into the mall and shoot up all these dudes. But when you progress on, you come to an enemy that's known as Sasquatch. And you can see her right there. Now this, I mean, my character here is quite low. Like real quite, and to be honest, I've done a few side missions where you probably get here lower level than this to be honest and this is where this glitch takes place so let me just grab the shotgun here works perfectly by the way so let's grab that grab the ammo and done so what you do with her is and the way to kill her is you need to shoot the thing on her back 
And where this works is best is you just runs out your dodge. Let us swing, not knock you down like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You need to shoot the thing on the back and I'll do it. 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 Come on in. Come on in. See that thing on the back there? That's where you gotta shoot out. Once you shoot that out, it becomes way easier. And she just takes up way more damage. Come on. Do that again. Come on, you're supposed to. There you go. It's shot then actually. There we go, now she's done. Now you just take her down. And I'll just run through the whole thing with you. When she does that to you, it actually doesn't do no damage to you. So you can beat she can beat you up all day long. And she is absolutely terrifying. Get off me, bitch! You <laughs> can grab her hammer. We just wanna just keep Oh damn. That's a good shot. And like I said, she ain't the easiest enemy to fight to be honest, I'm not gonna lie. Just aim for that head. Oh! Oh! Now she's almost dead, you'll see. There you go, now she's down. Now what you do is you notice that she actually isn't dead yet. And what you want to do here is you want to... Well, what are you doing? You want to create a save file just to be safe. And I ain't going to do it because I've already got the save. I don't really, I ain't really bothered about this, but you do want to create a save file. So I'll go into this, create a save, blah, 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 blah. And then you just want to kill her. And you'll see you'll get street cred and you can also you also get 30k edges i believe it is i didn't see that pop up but either way now what you want to do is you just want to reload that save so if you reload the save and like i said i've already got one so i don't need it so i'm going to load up mine which is back down here somewhere there it is you'll see when you reload back in she'll still be alive so you can shoot her again but you keep your xp now mine's going to obviously I don't know actually, I've been playing on this character since I've done this last, I think I have so you'll notice my level will have dropped, so it don't matter, but I'll still demonstrate to you people, I'll still demonstrate to you, my level will, yeah it definitely will drop, I've played on this character, let's have a look, I'm eight, uh, 14 and 18 so I ain't played much then, so let me just see, you can see that uh, the crosshairs are red still, so if we shoot her, and kill her, so you get the transfer 15k it is then, and you get the XP. Then what you do is now you save over. So you want to save over that save you last did. I'll show I'm gonna do and demonstrate to you. So save over that. Then what you want to do is you want to load that save back up. So you load the save back up, but you keep you keep your street cred XP, you keep those eddies, you keep your normal XP. But she's still alive again. Well that's what the glitch was before. That's how it used to work. If she's still alive now. We'll see. Whoa, that music just kicked in from nowhere, people. Okay, she's back on her feet. So that's bizarre. Can I take her down? Oh, oh. Oh, she just bugged out. Oh, they might have actually fixed this, people. Oh, no. No, no, no. Still works. She just... She's all just, just, just on her feet. <laughs> Patch 1.1 immortal enemies. Yeah, get out! Now now you're giving me my eddies. Now you're giving me my eddies. I will take them while I'm there. And what I'll do is I'll resave that just to make sure it does work because that was weird. <laughs> that was weird. Now I'm gonna load that back up. Yeah, people, I don't know what went down then. <laughs> I don't know what went down then, but she's just running around. That nothing had happened. So she should be on the floor now. She probably won't. She should probably still be standing. But I noticed that music ain't kicked back in. Okay, so yeah, she's down. Crosshairs are still red. Uh, my level is now 20, as you can see. Boom! There you go, another street cred level. 21. You get the, X, you get the money. But notice the Eddie's ain't there, Anna, which is bizarre but that's all good boom oh wow that was weird 
Did I, did, I, did I just kill her twice then? What actually happened then, people? Did I just get two levels from the one person? We're going to have to do that again. Hold up a minute. No, she's definitely dead now. She, she's definitely dead now. So let me just save that again. Save the game, save over that one. I'm pretty sure I leveled up twice. I'd have to go back over the footage, but... Unless I'm imagining things, I'm pretty sure I leveled up twice then, which is bizarre. Well, yeah, this seems... this works anyway. So, yeah, if you've started a new character, you get to this point of the game. When you first meet Placid Placide, I can't remember his name, and Bridget for the Voodoo Boys. And they make you go into this mall and you have to take out a group of enemies and you have to... Do all sorts, uh, plug in, yourself, jacking yourself into a van, then you come on to do this. So, still got that street cred level 22, but, but, she's got more health this time. Okay, so I got the eddies, but she's still got red crosshairs. That's bizarre. I think I'm getting two lots of XP. For sure, people. And I'm getting 30k eddies, by the way. So it is right, I was getting 30k before. But it seems to like it's kind of giving him in two amounts over the one death. Let's try that one more time. It's puzzling me. I'm getting two lots of 15k eddies and two lots of street cred XP. And I just whacked my mic, apologize about that. But yeah. Hmm, interesting, people. Interesting. But again, yes, voodoo boys, I walk the line, is it called? Yes, it is. What's my street good enough? 23. So, one, two. Okay, so now it's giving me 15k, 15k eddies, and it's giving me a street code level. But look, the red house cross has come back. Oh, now they're gone again. But it's giving me another 15k eddies. That's bizarre, but anyway people, if you want to use and abuse this, you can go ahead, but it definitely still works. And there we have it. Now if there's any other glitches um, you've tried and tested and can confirm work that I haven't covered today, because I've just covered the basics here really. I mean, everything else should probably still work, but I've just covered the basics. But if there's anything else you have covered, uh, I mean if you have tested, let us know down below in that comments section. But yes guys, this is one of those. Just for, I just, I just, I just wanted to, I'm just curious to see if they still work. And they do. So it's just one of those videos, people. But I do hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, it really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more cyberpunk on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, people, I will see you on that next one. I'm going back here. I'm going back. Peace, people.